The campaign for Birmingham mayor began in earnest today, the last day to file qualifying papers for the August 24 municipal elections. Coming into today, seven candidates have filed to challenge incumbent Birmingham mayor Randall Woodfin. Woodfin, Former Mayor William Bell, Chris Woods, Sarissa Brown and Darrell Williams have qualified for the ballot, according to the Jefferson County Probate Judges Elections Office. Three other mayoral candidates have filed their paperwork this week, since July 7, Irvin Hill II, Lashunda Scales and Napoleon Gonzalez. They are awaiting pending confirmation on their paperwork that has to be reviewed by the Alabama Ethics Commission. The campaign has already gone bare-knuckle with some hard hits. A website has been set up by an anonymous poster called Birmingham Truth Squad, that takes aim at the record of Scales, now a Jefferson County Commissioner. The attack on Scales has been promoted on social media. The Woodfin campaign says they have nothing to do with it. No, that is not affiliated with our campaign, said Claire Brixon, communications coordinator for the Woodfin campaign. All official campaign communications come through our website or the social media channels on our website. Scales said she's been told it was set up by a former official in Bell's administration. If that's the case, it could be the first salvo between the Bell and Scales campaigns in an effort to make a runoff with Woodfin, the overwhelming favorite. I'm not going to respond to it, Scales said. What they want to do is drag me in the mud. If Woodfin or some other candidate doesn't get 50% of the vote, a runoff will be held on October 5 between the top two vote-getters. Bell, as an incumbent, lost a runoff to Woodfin in 2017. A Birmingham Times poll taken last month showed Woodfin with a commanding lead of 52%, which would be enough to win without a runoff. Scales polled second with 10.8% and Bell was running a close third at 9.6%, according to the poll. Woods, Hill, Williams and Brown trailed the top three significantly, with none polling higher than 2.4% of the vote. The only city council member who has announced that he will not be running for re-election is Stephen Hoyt, who represents District 8. Candidates could file papers up to 5 p.m. today. By Friday morning, eight candidates had filed papers to run for Hoyt's seat, Carol Clark, Denise Weber Jenkins, Adlai Trone, Harry, Travelin Shoes, Turner, Barbara Files Kennedy, Wanda Wright, Salida Soto and Lynette Peters. The only candidate who appeared to have no challenges was Clinton Woods in District 1. District 2 Council member Hunter Williams has three challenges who had filed papers, Don Scott, Kimberly Ginty and Lawrence Conaway. District 3 Council member Valerie Abbott has two challenges, Alice Speak and Will Jones. Council President William Parker of District 4 waited until today to file papers.